Hello, I'm Brian Johnson. I'm an emergency physician. Today we're gonna to use the Clarius Pal ultrasound probe to visualize the femoral vein for a femoral central line. We won't be performing a central line today, but we're gonna visualize the vital structures. So typically the patient is lying supine and oftentimes you can put them in reverse trend Dellenberg. And typically I do a right femoral central line just because of I'm right hand dominant. And so what we'll do is we'll take the ultrasound probe and we'll go sort of along the inguinal crease. And if the patient can, slightly uh, bend out their leg to get better access to the inguinal crease. So we're gonna take the probe, kind of go along the femoral crease. What we initially identify are three sort of major structures of this inguinal crease area. And the three structures are the nerve, the artery, and the vein. Emergency providers are wonderful with the inguinal groin region, right? We do femoral nerve blocks, we do femoral central lines, we do femoral art lines, we do ultrasound DVT studies, so we're very knowledgeable about the inguinal area. And for our purposes today, what we're really looking for is the vein. The mnemonic I always use is navel, so nerve, artery, vein, empty lymph, and that's lateral to medial structures. You also can say venous to the penis, meaning the venous femoral vein is medial to the other structures. And so in this ultrasound view here, we're using a venous setting because we're going to do a venous central line. And what you immediately see are two structures. The more anterior structure that's somewhat pulsatile is our artery. And what sits a little deeper and medial is the femoral vein. If there's any question what is what, you can always compress down and see that the femoral vein is easily compressible while the femoral artery is still pulsatile and non-compressible. Also, if you slide laterally, you'll be able to see this nice triangular structure that fits just below the fascia iliaca, and that is our femoral nerve. So nerve, artery, and then vein. To cannulate, you'll be doing on a short axis view. You'll do sterile precautions and a normal Seldinger technique for a femoral central line. Ultrasound affords you better accuracy and minimizes complications. Thank you.